Welcome back to another episode of Real Ass Affirmations. I'm Chisa Penix Brown. I am your favorite mental wealth lifestylist, and I love to style your life with all the good shit. So today, I am talking to anybody, okay, anybody who is saying that they're not proud of their age. Anybody. So if it's you, and you're the type of person who's like, oh, I'm still 21 plus Bitch, add that number on there because whatever age you are, you are not 21 anymore, okay? If you are still saying, oh, you know, when I was younger and you're still doing that and kind of using that as an excuse and you're just trying to let people think that you're something other than you are, it does not matter if you continue to lie to people also about your age. If you are over 40, you should definitely be happy. And really, whatever age you are, You should be happy that you are still here because it's a bunch of motherfuckers that didn't make it, okay? So I want you to be proud of your age. And this is the thing. Why hide it? Because even if you're trying to hide it and you're lying to people about how old you are, your body knows how old you are. Your birth certificate knows how old you are, okay? Your mind that keeps lying to other people knows how old you are. Now, I know back in the day, women specifically wanted to always stay young but i'm gonna tell you something a lot of these young bitches ain't hitting on shit if you have gotten to the age that you are stop trying to be younger than you are be as bountiful and as beautiful as you are at your age and embrace it i remember back in the day i'm just like oh my god i don't want to get to 30 oh wow 30 seems old honey 30 was the shit all right (laughs) I don't know about what y'all was doing at 30, but 30 was the shit. I remember when I couldn't wait to get to 21. How is it that you be so excited to get to 18 and to 21? And when you get older, you realize you wasn't really shit. You might have been cute. You might have been handsome. You might have been all those things, but you didn't really know anything. It doesn't really happen where you start to really know who you are and what your purpose is until you get older. So I want you to be proud of your age. I don't give a damn how old you are. Be proud of it. Now, I'm going to tell you one person that I absolutely adore and she embraces her age like nobody else. And she has now made it to over 100. And she is one of my favorite inspirations when I think about a person that I would like to be like when I get older. And I don't know if you know her, but I'm going to just drop her name. Iris Apfel. Iris is one of the baddest chicks out here. She is 101 years old. Iris is the one that will give you those big glasses. She gives you a short haircut. She gives you a bounty of color. And she gives you all the jewelry pieces piled on top of each other. And guess why she's famous? For being Iris. She's famous for her style. She's famous for embracing her age. She's famous for her wrinkles. She's famous for her glasses that she needs because if she took them off, she probably couldn't see. She is famous for just embracing everything and being proud of who she is. And I am like the embodiment of something and someone like that. That's the type of person that I want to be. So, yeah, shit don't work like it used to work, okay? Things creak and crimp and they do all kinds of, they do the book sometimes (laughs) on this body that we have right now. But I'm proud of it, okay? And I want you to be proud of your age because there should be some wisdom that comes along with it. But if you are still doing stupid shit like trying to tell people that you are 10 and 20 years younger, you are doing yourself a disservice for everything that you have gained and learned through this time frame should be something that you revere in yourself. And so I am here to tell you to be proud of your age embrace who you are and embrace who you will be going into the future and it starts with you telling the truth to yourself and to other people about how old you are because let me tell you on the other side of that truth comes this magical wonderful thing where people are amazed that you are the age that you are They're like, oh my God, what? I didn't think you had. I didn't think you were. I thought you were younger than that. They're amazed because your spirit is just 
amazing. And so I'm telling you to embrace it and to be proud of your age because you deserve every day, every moment, every second of everything that is coming to you with the age that you are now. And God willing, you'll continue to grow and you'll continue to glow and you'll continue to be here to have more age. The wisdom that comes along with being proud of your age should allow you to embrace it fully. And that's all I have to say about that with your old ass. <laughs> okay, so listen, we are done with this episode of Real Ass Affirmations. If you loved it, listen to it again. Share it with somebody else because you know you have a friend out there with their old ass that's out here trying to act like they're way younger than they are and you want them to be proud of their age and embrace it as well. So um, share this episode, tag somebody, share it on social media and make sure that you always show up and show out. Continue to give it to the people and that's on Real Ass Affirmations, baby. Yeah, I heard this lady saying something. I was at this thing. She talking about, yeah, I'm too.